when I first saw that there are multiple games of Call of Duty for the Wii, I thought, wait, isn't this like mixing milk with mustard? I mean, Call of Duty has war, blood, violence, and is a trademark of other platforms, as the Nintendo Wii is known for more jolly, peaceful games, more happy games like Mario or Legend of Zelda. For starters, there are 5 Call of Duty games for the Wii. Call of Duty 3, Call of Duty World at War, Call of Duty Modern Warfare, Reflex, Call of Duty Black Ops, and Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3. Why they skipped Black Ops 2 is a mystery to me, and the internet couldn't solve my minute long problem. I guess because it wasn't profitable, since when Modern Warfare 2 came out, in that year they released Modern Warfare 1 and they thought that kids want only the latest game and don't want the middle of a golden trilogy that is a masterpiece anyway but don't worry kids it's not that big of a loss playing call of duty on the wii isn't as great of an experience as much as your imagination will tell you that it would turn out to be a great game the controls feel very Awkward. You point with the Wiimote and move with the nunchuck. Along the playthrough, they try to integrate the Wiimotes to imitate real motions you would do during a time of combat, but they turn out awkward too. The best way to play Call of Duty still remains the keyboard and mouse for ultimate precision or the console controllers with joysticks. They work nice too. But the Wiimotes, uh, they are okay. You can get used to them, but since there are better versions, why bother getting used to the Wiimote controls? The game doesn't even look as good as the other versions. It is indeed good looking for the Wii and some effects and scenes look jaw dropping, but still, as ok as the Wii games are and as good as they look, since there are better versions out there, the PC and Xbox and PS3 versions. These games are worth trying only for novelty reasons, only, just to check out how they play, at least that's my recommendation, cause they are not bad games, they are just awkward to play. Also there is no online component in any of the games, you can't play online, I don't know why you would like to play online on the Wii versions of Call of Duty, but yeah, it, it doesn't have online, nor the zombie mode. But the games made me realize something, that a masterpiece is a masterpiece, meaning that Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare is still very enjoyable and still pretty much a masterpiece even on the Wii. Even with the awkward controls, the game still is a masterpiece and it still engages you. And same goes for other titles, like for example Call of Duty Black Ops, it's still an amazing game. and pretty much the same masterpiece, even with the awkward controls. So let's just take a moment and realize with what amazing games Activision bestowed us. Ok so this was the video, if you liked it please hit the like button and subscribe, if you want to support me in my pursuit to review as many video games as possible, click the join button and choose one of the perks. If you want you can follow me on Twitch, Instagram or Discord, I've left the links to those in the video description and if you want to see another video of mine just wait till I stop talking and there will be thumbnails of other videos I've made. Thanks for watching!